today we are going to see a very important concept in power system operation and control that is spinning reserve spinning reserve is a type of operating reserve and is defined as the extra power generating capacity of the generator that is already synchronized to the system this extra power is achieved by increasing the torque of the turbine rotor in the case of steam and gas turbine spinning reserve is controlled by combustion in the combustion chamber and in micro hydro it is controlled by the flow rate of the falling water through the turbine spinning reserve is considered more reliable in distribution generation since during a blackout startup issues are not faced and spinning reserve is used for battery efficiency during peak load demand so the service definition reflects traditional thermal generating asset for example a coal power plant which can take hours to heat up synchronize with the grid power frequency and begin generation so in recognition of this the spinning reserve generators are compensated through this mechanism to use fuel to be in hot standby spinning and ready to quickly synchronize and generate the spinning reserve is defined as a unloaded generation that is rotating in synchronism with a utility grid that is the spinning generator is rotating at a speed that will produce power at precisely the same frequency as the frequency of the grid power thus the spinning reserve can be brought online within a minute to serve additional load demand or to compensate for unanticipated loss of a operating generator in conventional power plants generators at fossil fuel plants nuclear plants and hydroelectric power plants that are running at partial load and can quickly increase output the grid operators procure these services that is uh, the spinning reserve services to ensure they have uh, sufficient reserves to handle the contingencies now we'll see the activation time activation time for the spinning reserve can typically be activated within 10 minutes or less the spinning reserve can typically be activated within 10 minutes or less than that and this rapid response time is essential to counteract the effects of sudden disruptions now we'll see some advantages of a spinning reserve immediate response so spinning reserve can be brought into online almost instantly usually within seconds to minutes providing quick support during sudden drop in supply or spikes in the demand this rapid response helps maintain grid frequency and voltage stability preventing blackouts and ensuring a reliable power supply second one is a high reliability as the generators providing spinning reserves are already synchronized with the grid there are no delay associated with starting up or synchronizing in distribution generating systems spinning reserve enhances reliability as they are immediately supply power without startup issues during outages and third one versatility spinning reserve can come from various sources including fossil fuel plants hydro power plants energy storage system offering flexibility in grid management they can also be part of a demand response program where power consumption is adjusted to balance supply and demand effectively now we'll see some disadvantages of spinning reserve first one is a higher operating cost so maintaining spinning reserve requires generators to run at partial load which can lead to higher fuel consumption and operating cost compared to idle or uh, offline generators continuous operations even at reduced load can increase wear and tear on the equipment which leads to higher maintenance cost and second one inefficiency in load demand period during periods of load demand the capacity reserved as spinning reserve may be underutilized leading to inefficiencies and the potential wastage of resources this can impact the economic performance of power plant as they may not be operating at a optimal efficiency third one environmental impact running fossil fuel based generators at partial load for spinning reserve purpose can result in higher emission per unit of electricity generated compared to operating at full load this can raise sustainability concerns and impact efforts to reduce the carbon footprints of power generation then fourth one complexity in management so managing spinning reserve require careful coordination and real time monitoring 
to ensure that the reserve capacity can be deployed effectively when needed integrating various sources of spinning reserves such as renewable energy and battery storage add complexity to the grid management and requires advanced control system now we'll see some applications of uh, spinning reserve first one is a grid stability and reliability spinning reserve helps to maintain the balance between the supply and demand ensuring the grid frequency remains within the specified range and they provide immediate power to support voltage levels especially during the sudden disturbances or fault in the system now, second one emergency power supply spinning reserve acts as a first line of defense against blackouts by providing immediate power when the power generator fails or when there is a sudden spike in the demand and they assist in the recovery process after a fault by providing the necessary power to restore normal operation quickly and third one integration of renewable energy while the increasing integration of renewable energy sources like uh, wind and solar which can intermittent by nature spinning reserves helps balance the grid when these sources are not producing power they provide the necessary backup to ensure smooth integration of renewable energy into the grid reducing the need of curtailment and ensuring the stable power supply next one support for distributed generation in distribution generation system spinning reserves enhance local reliability by providing immediate power support reducing the dependency on uh, central power plants they are particularly important in microgrids where they ensure stability and reliability by quickly compensating for fluctuations in the power supply and demand next one peak load demand spinning reserves can be used to during uh, peak load periods uh, to provide additional power helping to level the load and prevent overloading of the grid they can be a part of demand response strategies where uh, the reserve capacity is used to meet peak demands reducing the need for expensive peak power plants next one industrial and commercial application so this industry and commercial entities rely on spinning reserve to ensure uninterrupted operations especially in processes that are sensitive to power interruptions they provide essential backup power in critical facilities like hospitals data centers and financial institutions where power continuity is vital next one economic and market application the spinning reserves are a key component of ancillary services market where they can trade it to ensure grid reliability and stability by preventing blackouts and reducing the need for peaking plants spinning reserves can lead to significant cost saving for utilities and grid operators